Hi, YouTube. Um, this is this is um a book review on one of my favorite books, a series of fortunate events. This is the bad beginning, the first um book. It's backwards, but um this book is very shocking and interesting, and I recommend you read it. So. There are 13 books in the series. I'm reading the second one right now. Um, this is The Reptile Room. Again, it's the, a series of unfortunate events. And so, what's what this book is about is um, these three siblings, and they their names are Klaus, Violet, and Sunny. Sunny is the baby. Klaus is the brother, and Violet is oldest, which is the sister. So Klaus is the second oldest. And so what happens is um, their parents get into a bad fire, which is this picture, and they, they die in the beginning, unfortunately. And they ha this book is about, like, occurrences, or events that happen that each occurrence or event that happens leads on to another. So they have pretty bad luck. So they have bad, uh, very bad luck. Um, and what happens is they're, this guy, he is good friends with their, was good friends with their parents. His name is Mr. Poe, and he works with the bank, and their parents had told him that if anything was to happen to them, that, um, they were rich, by the way, um, that's why the house is pretty big, um, that the kids should be passed on to the first relative on, like, the list or whatever, the list of, like, family members that were like related to them so the first one on that re list or um that relative was count olaf so this is count olaf he's pretty evil um so as you can probably see in the background there's this eye on the wall and you'll see throughout the book that that's the evil eye so it's everywhere it rep it kind of represents count olaf so Count Olaf, um, well, you'll see in the book that the eye is very significant to Count Olaf, and he, the evil eye represents him. So Count Olaf is after their fortune. So they have very bad lives and that. So a few significant things. In this picture... As you can see, the um, baby is biting the circle. The reason for that is the baby likes to bite things. So, I don't know why. She just likes biting things and stuff. So, like, she makes sounds also. And each sound, only the brother and sister could tell what she's saying. So, in this picture, she's biting on a um, teething ring. So, you could probably get she likes to bite things. So that's pretty significant. So each event that happens leads to another. So let me just read you the first um, books. The back cover, which is the thing that talks about the book. So, dear reader, I'm sorry to say that the book you are holding in your hands is extremely unpleasant. It tells an unhappy tale about three... Very unlucky children, even though they are charming and clever, the Baudelaire siblings led lives filled with misery and woe, or woo. It's W-O-E. Everyone pronounces that word differently, so. From the very first page of this book, when the children are at the beach and receive terrible news, continuing on through the... Entire story, disaster lurks at their heels. One might say that they are magnets for misfortune. In this sort of, in this short book alone, the three youngsters 
encounter a greedy and repulsive villain. Itchy clothing, a disastrous fire, a plot to steal their fortune, and cold porridge for breakfast. It is my, my sad duty to write down these unpleasant tales, but there is nothing stopping you from putting this book down at once and reading something happy, if you prefer that sort of thing. With all due respect, Lemony Snicket. That's the author. So, it... At first, when I read that, I was a little, a little skeptical about reading the book, but it's a pretty good book, so you should definitely read it. If you read it, comment down below, tell me that you've read it, or that you're going to read it, and um, if, if you want a shout out, then just tell me, and so, yeah, so just let me know, and... Like subscribe, like, subscribe, and tell your friends about my channel. So keep on watching for more videos to come and read this book. Bye.